Hello, my name is Joshua Stuckey, and I'm giving a speech for IDLA, which stands for Idaho Digital Learning. My speech is going to be on um, body modifications such as tattoos and piercings. Now, piercings, people think about them, and some, some people think that it causes no harm to them, or, and will never. But it causes many effect, defects, and it's just a waste of money, in my opinion. Here's an example of someone that had had multiple piercings and tattoos. And, uh... From its earliest periods of use, tattoos and piercings have been a way of expressing yourself and just getting some individuality on your body. It started early, as far as we know, with a man named Captain Cook who went on a Tahitian expedition in 1771 and came up with a name for the tattoo, which he come up, came up with with a, a Tahitian <coughs> word called tatau, which, stand, which is what the machine, the tattoo machine would make, what the sound it would make when people are using it. And as far as we know, t tattoos and piercings have been around since ancient Egyptian times and have been used from the Roman times till now. Egyptians and Romans would use it for celebrations and to show masculinity and just to show that they are superior than other people. In the 19th century, people would, who got tattoos, the tattooists would use urine, tobacco juice, saliva, and dirty water to facilitate the tattooing process. <laughs> but since the 20th century came around, regulations have revolutionized conditions of tattoo parlors, dramatically decreasing rates of infections and so on, etc. Tattoos modern days, in modern days, a study was shown and the results were given on a natural news, or a natural news article and it stated that 36% of Americans from 25 to 29 had at least one body tattoo in 2003. It also stated that inks from tattoos are injected deep into the, bo into the body and deep enough that it, it, most tattoos will not burn away. Most tattoos can cause mutagenic, ca capable of causing mutations, teratogenic, capable of causing birth defects, and carcinogenic, capable of causing cancer, and other biochemical reactions in the body. There, a study was done in a neighborhood of five million and tattoos affected them in ways like scarring, photogenic reactions, and other <coughs> adverse effects. Another effect from tattoos includes skin infections, other chronic skin conditions, and tumors. And they are also associated with tattoos. They also result in Tetanus, herpes, AIDS, hepatitis B and C, and syphilis. syphilis. Because of these effects, foreign countries have banned tattoos. Massachusetts, Oklahoma, South Carolina, and Vermont. Eleven other states have regulate tattooists because of these. Alaska, Arkansas, Hawaii, Iowa, Kentucky, Maine, Oregon, Rhode Island, South Dakota, West Virginia, and Texas. Another form of body modification is piercing, such as earrings. A study was done by the nurse practitioners, the American Journal of Primary Healthcare, and they wrote in an article that people from 18 to 23 years old, they made an estimation of piercing prevalence 
from 30% to 50%. Reasons for getting piercings have been identified, such as identifying with a particular group of people, identifying with a specific age group or social ranking, belief in magical powers, desire to appear ferocious and attractive, and sexual stimulation, risk factors associated with body piercings, common and uncommon, are bleeding, local infection, and increased risk of infective endocarditis. Researchers have, con researchers have concluded that the presence of tattoos or body piercings in adolescents does not necessarily indicate risk-taking behavior, which is another reason that people get tattoos. But the president should alert parents, teachers, and healthcare providers a possibility of greater healthcare risks. Body modifications have been used for decades and for many different reasons. I believe that the negative consequences of body modifications, such as tattoos and piercings, far outweigh the reasons people get them. Our bodies are perfect and do not need any modifications to enhance it in any way. Thank you for listening to my speech.